the committee concluded as follows. One, an increase in the national daily minimum wage by 10% over the 2022 national daily minimum wage, which translates into a new national daily minimum wage of 14 cities, 88 pesos, and a cost of living allowance of 15% over the 2023 national daily minimum wage. The effective date for the implementation of the 2023 National Daily Minimum Wage shall be 1st January 2023. All establishments, institutions, or organizations whose daily minimum wage, wages are below the new rates should adjust accordingly effective 1st January 2023. Any establishment, institution, or organization that flouts the 2023 National Daily Minimum Wage shall be sanctioned in accordance with the law. The NTC recommends that the 2023 National Daily Minimum Wage should be tax exempt. This is a, through, a true vindication of the essence of tripartism. We are forever committed to this cause and we know that we are in all of this together and working together, we shall overcome whatever challenge that lies ahead of us. And at the end of the day, Ghana will be the winner. In the last few months, we have had situations where inflation is going up. We should all work together to make sure we are out of this, workers, employers, and government. And we are hoping that 2023 will be a better year than 2022. Uh, it is on this note that I would like to appeal to all of us, workers, employers, and government, to continue to work together in the spirit of uh, peace so that we can get out of this. Uh, otherwise, it doesn't matter how much you offer your empl employees, how much government will offer employees, and how much employers will offer employees. It will, not, it will still not take us home.